So, uh, anyway, first snacky hypers that we're going to review is, um, his awesome, or that, and then it has a warning, uh, contains poisonous chemicals, do not ingest if human. Okay, let's gently fucking open this. I hate even, like, tearing a slight bit of these. It's a shame. They're such cool works of art, and <laughs> I'm destroying them all. I literally don't even know what it is as well, so it's kind of cool. This is weird. This is not something I've encountered before. Okay, so I opened it up, and it's individually packaged. Like, there's tons of them. They're all individually packaged. This is such a waste of packaging. <laughs> okay, whatever. I'm going to try one of these. They look like something... It's like a chalk candy, maybe? Like a chocolate chalk candy? Let's chow down, shall we? Ooh, definitely chocolate. Ooh. Ooh, I like that. It smells like... It smells like chocolate cereal, kind of. Like, uh, like Wheatos or something. Incredibly fucking hard. It's actually alright. It literally is, um, you know like that stuff the necklaces are made out of, like the, the chalky shit, and you get the chalky lollipops, it's literally that, but chocolate flavour, and it's kind of like a dark chocolate flavour. I feel like chalk candy never goes off anyway, so I don't see why, again, the unnecessarily, unnecessarily packaged star shapes, but whatever. I'm going to give them maybe... Like, I would pick these up if I saw them. So I'm going to give them... A 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10. Boom. Done. Moving on. Okay, now next we have... This... Fucking thing. Which... Has a frog on it. And I don't know why he's on it. But I'm hoping to God aim frog flavored crisps, cause that'd be fucking gross. So that's something. I don't know why he'd be on the packaging saying like, oh yeah, make sure you recycle or whatever the fuck he means. <laughs> it does look weirdly like E. T. Now that I'm focusing on it a bit more. It doesn't smell like frog, what I'd imagine frog would smell like. Kinda like dirt and wet. It smells nice. It smells like Monster Munch. Oh, these are fucking Pog Champ. Oh, the Frog Crisps. Definite buy. Definite buy. Go and buy these. It's like the texture of Monster Munch. It's like I think they're like spring onion flavored, maybe. Definitely like an oniony taste to it though, like a herby oniony taste. Anyway, I'll move on. I'm eating these later though. These are fucking good. These, ten out of ten. Would recommend. If you see these frog crisps, Pag Champion, get them. I don't know what brand they are. I'm actually going to look at what they are. Actually, oh, we should be looking at what these are afterwards anyway. So, first thing we had was Crayon Shinchan Chinobi Ramun Ramun Cocoa Flavor. Okay, then these are... Cabbage taro balls of corn snack flavoured with small pieces of seaweed and Japanese brown sauce. Well, they're fucking good. Uh, nice autofocus, by the way. Next, we got another one of these things that I had last time. These, like, long tubes. I think in Japan they probably just put them in fucking tubes for some reason. Because there's just a bunch of these tube-looking things. I don't know if they have an obsession with tubes. It's all a series of tubes. But they look good from what I saw on the packet. Looks like a like a crispy Nutella type deal, and he sure as hell's happy about it. So let's try it. I may have to tear this slightly, just to fucking alleviate some air pressure or some shit. Make a positive pressure pocket. Oh, this smells good. This smells no. <laughs> I tore it. <laughs> oh well, they look like um perfet rolls. That's what they're called, perfet rolls without the chocolate on top. They kind of feel like it too. They're very spongy. Oh, it's, it's weird. 
It's not like regular chocolate spread. It's like it's got some weird sweet taste to it. You know how it's just usual chocolate spread tastes like chocolate? This has kind of got like a sugary aftertaste. <laughs> what the fuck? I just read what the hell it is. Umai Tama Mini Cream Puffs contains calcium. It contains calcium, apparently. So I think that means it contains milk chocolate. They are what they are. They're like sort of not as good profiteroles. Have you heard of profiterole? You've had a better version of this. I'm going to give these an 8 out of 10. Good. They're good. Could be better, but they're good. Okay, moving on to the next one. Probably one of the cutest fucking things we've actually opened so far is this. It's a chimp, just like me, the ape man. So, this is a weird little bit of packaging because on the back it is a little flap right where its anus is, and I think you're supposed to, like, maybe this is going to pour out like chocolate monkey shit or something. I don't know. A bit TOS. Sorry, I'm going to get banned if I show that. Uh, so I don't know what's even in this, but, oh, you unfold the head? Okay, the monkey's face comes off. I am removing the monkey's face. Ooh, what is this? Okay, so I took them out. It's got a nice little story inside, I think. I don't read... Japanese, so my camera probably will not detect it in good enough quality for someone who does read Japanese to detect what that says. But I'm sure it's something joyful like open monkey, find candy, enjoy many year, or some shit like that. <laughs> so yeah. Now we have this. It's like BB pellets. I'm eating a purple one. I don't know why everything in Japan is balls, but I mean, I'm not complaining. Oh god, it's like I just ate perfume. Pretty good. Not gonna, not gonna lie, these are actually pretty fucking good. Okay, purple one's good. Pink one's alright. It kind of tastes like, um, if you've ever had cow pole, the medicine, it has that kind of weird taste to it. Green one. Oh, oh, what the fuck is that? Ew, no. Yeah, no, do not like the green one. It is... Animal poo shaped chocolate. Huh. This is not chocolate. I hate to break it to you, Japan. This is not what chocolate tastes like. But yeah, it is supposed to be animal shit. And I think what you're supposed to do is instead of having them in this little bag, you're supposed to put them in the box and then it comes out its ass and it's like a pez. So yeah, we'll do a nice little tutorial here of uh, what this is going to be like. Just going to close him back up. There. Japanese engineering. We now have a monkey. Uh, that that shits in your hand. Shit. Got to eat his ass a little bit. Hmm. Green. Terrible. Oh shit. No. 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 It's falling everywhere. Okay. We'll close this ass flap up. We'll save these for later. There you go. Purple ones are the best ones. First one I tried. Best flavor. Pink. Eh. I could take it or leave it. Green. Eh. It's like trash apple. Don't eat it. So I'm going to give the monkey anus. Um, six out of ten. I could take it or leave it. I, I wouldn't personally pick it up, but if someone had them, I'd be like, hey, give me some of that monkey's anus. You know? Give me the anus pellets. That's what I want. That's why I'd probably say to that. The thing I would say is the best out of all of these, frog crisps. Every time frog crisps. Just, just fucking chow down on some goddamn frog crisps. Good snacks. Good snacks. Good people. Hey, give me some of that monkey's anus.